May the best of us win, Shekans. Play my commands at all times. Protect yourselves. Ten rounds of action in the catch rate category. 49.450 kilograms. These blokes are under 50 kilograms in South Africa. You're not even allowed to donate blood at this at this weight category. <laughs> Imagine that. But these guys, wow, they're going to turn it on. The bell is for the start of round number one. Both boxers fighting out of the orthodox stance. The executioner against uh, Sain Tong Thor Sirachai. Wichet Sank Prapan. The right hand over the top immediately from the executioner. What, Ricky Jabalala, are you anticipating in this one? Well, what I'm anticipating is... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you fine? Come close. Come close. Come close. Taking a shot here. This is Sam. This is Colin. Shocker. My word. Didn't anticipate that. Butler with a knockout. Victory. And I'm looking back in my records to see when he last won by knockout. It was in 2014 against the Thai fighter, Witcher, the pull of Kyle in Monte Carlo. For the IBO World Minimum and WBA World Minimum title, which he was defending for the first time, but the IBO title he was defending for the sixth time. It's been nine years since he scored a knockout victory. Tonight, he scores it within how many seconds? Uh, nothing over... <laughs> 30, 40 seconds in the round. And listen, this was one of those fights that Hickey had to put together. You know, we, he said that he's going to be fighting for the world title in August. So this was definitely one of those fights, a keep busy fight. We didn't anticipate that it would end so quickly. I mean, he had a durable opponent in front of him in which it sang Prakong. But the right punch landed at the right time, and unfortunately, it was an early night for Sempakon. But uh, fortunately for Hickey, he gets the W and gets to walk off into his next fight with a little bit more confidence. Absolutely, 35 wins and 11 by way of knockouts for Sempakon. The uh, 12th loss and uh, 10 of them by way of knockout, by the way. So he does have a rather poor knockout record as far as his losses are concerned. He's only lost one. Uh, fight by way of a points decision, uh, Semprakan. So congratulations to the executioner. And we wish him well for that bout against the Japanese fighter Kenshiro Tenja. Let's have a look at this again. Oh, bang on the button. Big right hand. Good match. There's that body shot that he threw. Looked like a left hook, so he doubled up with it. He actually caught it. Caught uh, Semprakan's punch. But you see how he opened him up with the left hand to the body. Now look at this again. He opens him up with the, with the left to the body. Look at the right hand does. He drops the right hand, trying to throw the left hook in response. Pays the price. Let's go upstairs to Devon Kara. Ladies and gentlemen, before I announce the official results, I'd like to acknowledge the presence of board member of Boxing South Africa as well as the CEO and COO of Boxing South Africa. It's Eric Sitole, Mando Nklanganiso, and KK Kudile Radu. Right, ladies and gentlemen, that brings to the end an astounding night of action. And let's go to the official time. 43 seconds into round number one. Your winner, coming by way of knockout from South Africa. Hecky Executioner Butler! He barely had time to warm up. He's, he hasn't even broken a sweat. Beautiful left to the body, left hook upstairs, but his opponent was trying to throw a left hand of his own. And Hickey uh, Butler with a winner in the opening round. I'm sure he would have liked more rounds, but he didn't get it tonight. It's a fabulous, fabulous victory. Let's hear what Hayden says in conversation with the champ. Let's go. All right, so I'm standing here with Hecky, the executioner Butler. The idea of tonight was to get in some quality rounds. You've got a big WBC title looming. You got one round, you had the shots, and you took him out. What's your emotions like? I didn't expect it to happen because we were playing to go to the body. I, I just touched him in the body and just went up. I didn't know it was that hard of a shot, but I caught him. I could see I caught him clean on the button. 
So the risk is gone now. The fight is out of the way. You are the fighting pride of South Africa. One of the greatest of all time. Your next fight. Are you ready for that one now? Ask my coach. If he says I'm ready, I'm ready. You know that. Let's move over quickly to Colin Nathan, the trainer of Hecky Butler. I mean, it, it took 43 seconds to get his opponent out of there. Did you anticipate that? No, I thought it'd go a few rounds. But with regards to your question to Hecky, as they say in Japanese, Konnichiwa, Taraji, we're coming for you in August. Get ready to lose those belts, my guy. Well, there we have it. I mean, Heki, do you have a message there for Tiraji as well? Because he is going around currently as the best in your weight division. You can have a chance to win the Ring Magazine for a second time, being the first ever South African to do that. And it will be a great honor, and I believe I can beat him. I like fighting um, when the odds are stacked against me. I think I'll sound better then, but yeah, I'll... I'm going to be ready. I've got the right cornerman in my corner. I've got the right backing. I know what I'm doing. I've got Scott to the yard. He helps me with my strength. You can see it's working. One shot and I put the guy out. I'm feeling good. I'm going to be the new WBC, WA and Ring Magazine champion. It's probably bad manners of me not to tell you to take a gum shield out of that time. But you're sounding a lot better. <laughs> oh, now you can hear what I'm saying. I should, you should start over. All right. Well, we can't do that. But Hecky, you've got uh, some you know, big, big steps uh, that you have to take in training still i mean it's you still have to get there and you still have to go to japan and win the belts i mean this is probably your last fight in south africa i never say never but uh for the time being yes i'm prepared for the world titles i'm probably going to take a week two off and get back to training if august is close it's around the corner time flies quick we need to get back into it and be back go, going at it and, and i want to like i want to be i want to be a legit world champ again and i want to i want to win more and more and more we got something special waiting for you right here. You got a belt waiting to your right hand side. If I can get Alan Norman to quickly present you with the title. In recognition of your service to South African boxing, we wish you the best of luck for your eliminator and your title fights. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. And one one last request was a, a quick message from from Colin Nathan. Yeah, I want to say a big shout out to Larry and Rios from Boxing 5. I think you guys were happy with tonight's boxing. It's great to bring the crowd back out. And you know what? This is the first of many. It's just like well done to Boxing 5, Larry and Rios. Well, there we have it. Hecky, the executioner, Butler. Congratulations once again. We had the main event.